Okay, so it, the black springs came in it, what? and then it has a set of weaker small springs and a set of stronger small springs. So the long ones make it more stable, the short ones make it less stable. And then it only has one set of big springs, which are pretty weak, but they're also bigger. So I think that makes it a little bit more stable, but only if you add them to small springs, like you can't use them by themselves or it would be really unstable. And then these centers make it less stable because the centers can like move this way more with them. Okay. The black screws and silver screws are also different. Supposedly the black ones are more stable, but I'm not, I don't know why. And also, if you use the big springs, you need to have that cross piece uh -huh. uh, to hold them down because the big springs are wider than the screw head. And we still haven't figured out how to make it maglev. Yeah, supposedly <laughs> you can put magnets in the cross piece to make it maglev, but I don't see where else you'd put magnets down here. Oh, wait. Are those magnet slots? Maybe just like on the bottom there? Just. But that wouldn't be strong enough. enough. So and maybe it's also just, there's nothing they would just move around. You would glue them, but well, maybe it's just do, a little bit. Of, maybe it's just for a little bit of maglev. Uh, um, so you have that, the different screws, the micro actuators don't do anything, but they also don't fit if you're using the big spring or yeah, big springs because the cross piece takes up the same space that those would take up. So if you use them, the screws are too high and the center caps don't fit. 